Good morning guys, Diana here from Garden Love. So I think today is gonna be the morning where I'm doing tons of updates just because spring is here. Um, it's early in the morning so we're enjoying the beauty of the day which is the sunshine and um, there's tons of things going on in my garden. I'm so excited that finally things are blooming and looking amazing. And um, this video I want to update, update you guys on my navel orange if you guys remember uh, a few weeks ago I took some giant giant orange from this tree and it was so so sweet and what I didn't tell you guys is that I left most of those oranges on my tree weeks after I did that video and the oranges were even sweeter so what I'm learning now is that the longer you leave your oranges in your tree closer towards spring the sweeter your fruit will be that also applies to my conquads because I used to eat them right away and I actually left some on my tree and I've been picking at them lately which right now we're in April and I've had them all winter long and they are so much sweeter now so just a little tip and food for thought because if you're anything like me as soon as i see fruit on any of my trees i want to get it and eat it so um there is a catch to that birds or rodents might get to it before you do so just kind of weigh those things out before you decide to leave them on the tree and then just not enjoy them at all so i wanted to give you guys an update on my tree now this was i think i had about 10 fruits on this tree growing in a container which is not bad um i left them on there and just whenever my daughter or and i were craving a, um, an orange we would come out here and get it i did put a trellis on there i don't know why I, i'm considering growing this as Belair and retraining it um so i'm just gonna regardless of where this tree goes whether i do it as Belair or not my yard is so small that it's gonna have to be leaning against a wall somehow even if i just let it bush out so um that's what i'm doing i'm gonna not let those branches go behind that um, trellis but what i wanted to show you today is all these amazing blooms i mean if you look at this tree basically every single branch has blooms it's covered with them and it is um it smells amazing for those of you who garden like I do, you if you guys walk through the neighborhood and you smell that distinctive smell, you know it's a citrus tree because the smell is just amazing. But as you can see, there is so, so many blooms everywhere. So I'm very excited to have more fruit next next season than this season look at all of this amazing amazing look at the beauty of the day shining through these beautiful flowers and i actually my neighbor has a tree next to us and i want to show you how amazing his blooms are as well sneak peek look at that it is completely loaded, just like my tree. Completely, completely loaded. I'm gonna try to zoom in so you guys can see all these amazing blooms sitting on this tree. Amazing, guys. So I do see some bees. Um, so I'm really excited that some of these, <clears throat> some of these blooms are gonna get pollinated and we're gonna have more fruit than we did last year i am considering transplanting this tree because it's been here for about five years <clears throat> so i am considering it putting in a putting this in a wine barrel so that way it has a little bit more space to grow and hopefully it can hold <clears throat> sorry <clears throat> hopefully it can hold some more fruit this upcoming season and we can enjoy it because um yeah i want to i want to say it even had more than five five um i mean sorry more than eight oranges i should have counted them but i didn't but i know that the, the <laughs> there was a week where my whole family was sick and i just kept coming out 
and grabbing an orange because those oranges made me feel so good and I was enjoying all the vitamin C from it and it was amazing so I do need to start fertilizing my trees I'm kind of late to it this year but they all seem to be doing great I'll probably do that today as well we'll see what I get have time to do because I gotta clean my house as you guys all know there's tons of chores to do but anyways guys just this quick update I'm not gonna ramble anymore there's other updates and other videos that I want to record for you guys this morning so let's get to those okay I hope you guys have a blessed day and I'll see you guys in the next one bye bye